Okay, so the the Lira project um, is a project that uh, is funded by the International Science Council, and it's meant to build you know research capacity in in Africa, and mainly focuses on projects that are you know meaningful to people who are being researched. In other words, it focuses on what they call transdisciplinary you know research approaches, where research inquiries should be more or less aligned with the needs of local communities. So I would say briefly, that is the main purpose of, the, of this study, of this research. Uh, so so, so what, we, we, what I mean here is that we kind of build bridges between the academics and local communities and other stakeholders who have got an interest in issues that affect them. It could be water, it could be sanitation, it could be uh, energy. Uh, it could be housing and so forth and so on. Generally, in the thing, the project, the project, the fruitful cool. So it has helped the community. It has helped people. So overall, I feel it's a positive project, and it's it's been able to achieve positive results. So generally, I think it's a good project. Siye sati sitle sasa la pansi kunye singa ba sali ba se makanda na ba suka pili tande le lo fundo la se roots kunye nati zi champions sa kuazi sa jonga ba indo umtelingi ni esi jonga ne na u malunga numba ni so sitle sa 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 sala sa engage sa kuazi sa funu konda ba na ba umtelingi ni singa u jonga njani singa u solve njani. So each part meaning abasha le basema kanda and the champions in university si kwa zile ufumana is solution a better engas neither as individual and also as a household. Ngos, the project in nite kakulu kwa bangu kunda kwa zu usaiva imali and then ansa kupi imali eni nzi ezba nani kupa pifofo u nansi ka umba because bangkalele in was nini ba I can switch off in and see the e lights to save umban. E lights G, but the light on G. The ones who save again will turn the switch off. We now see the keys and the switch off. The keys and the D light. The other class will turn the phone. I will send this switch off in microwave because it's all in microwave. E lighting. If the switch off is plugging, at least I can save umban. So in the day I call because in the day I will turn umban a hundred rand. Uh, last year for e for this, but now they are ten umban the seven grand. I last more than they are four days because because their switcher is a unnecessary thing. Is not in the news user they are trying to get umban. And in other cool because in the end of was we call it a in a city external feminism. Uba we call it so umban it can no save and in the end all for. You say what for banani? So now about release again, we go amazing, we go banya ban. So we go quasi le uti le project and let them name the quasi we let banya ban do ba ba save umban. You ever since that all the project, the all the unat. I am so go obem cool. Long to get on a band on a band painting. The bad one look good. No. I could write the Yosef Suman, Fanny Nelson was so. Um, the girl. But the Catabanda Nakabe is a vassa. Babi Lisa Mansi, a cup of cup as a style of hire. Go to Mussels of Pinawa to make a solving cellular vass. So, the Vacalel could know Kula project is fund the sweat in the old banner. So, to Wabi Lisa Amans, Cotta was a vass. Now we are born again. We go to the doctor's job. The nurse didn't die. We born to make sure that people are being good. That we born to put it. Umba nengo ba ausa keki. Go la shabolo kasha. We put it in the car. Um. So what we are trying to do is to look at how we can uh, encourage savings in the households uh, for several reasons. So what we Called the sustainability challenge um, is that uh, there is a sustainable energy use within households, not only in Makanda but in different parts uh, of South Africa and other countries in the world. Um, 
and the challenge is that if there is wasteful energy use, like for example, if we don't maybe switch off our lights when we go to bed or we're traveling, if we don't turn off our TVs um, and so forth, the issue is that there's going to be high usage of electricity. But what is being produced is not enough to cover the demand or what we need. So what happens usually, things that we can see is that when there's load shedding, people can, can start seeing how wasteful behaviors can actually you know, lead to load shedding. So imagine if you're wasting a bit here in Makanda, and all the communities in South Africa are wasting, how much energy is being lost? That's one thing. <coughs> Number two, we are saying if we can save energy or electricity in our households, it also means that we reduce our bills on electricity. I like it when you say that you want to take members of the community. Who gonna be people that are doing the very same activity within their communities? Which is, is critically clear because the people are going to walk the talk and those people are being known to that community. I'm, I'm impressed. It's going to make a, a huge impact in terms of the community. Um, the last part of it is that uh, I wanted to come close to the issue. I'm here when you said you don't want to politicize this thing. Uh, I, want, I want to suggest the relevant, fortunately, the, state of, the office of state is relevant. But the relevant office, when it comes to the outgoing or incoming correspondence when it relates to local government, is the office of the municipal manager. Okay. Critically, so for the municipal manager is the head of the administration. No, no, like tips. It tips is like energy saving tips. Energy saving tips. Oh, not just in the matter of the tips. <laughs> <laughs> No, the thing is, I wrote a uh, so, about tips, so I wanted to write down so we'd have got nothing because you didn't. <laughs> 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 yeah, because I haven't learned. Like, mm -hmm. I would go to household and then people must be okay. Yeah, so, you bought, you bought it. so yeah. how do I do this thing? Sure. So that's what I want to know. So, from our work here in Makanda and Kumasi in Ghana, I would say that we have. To a, to a great extent achieved the, the project outcomes. Why do I say this? Uh, one of the main outcomes was to be able to work with different stakeholders, like municipal authorities, local users of electricity given the challenges of unsustainable practices. And we've built bridges where we came to the same or get into the same room or the same table to discuss uh, issues that are of concern and that are meaningful to the local people. Uh, and, and I think this project, to me, it is more about the process, not about the impact. So having an impact, for example, reduced electricity consumption is a plus. But, but at the moment, I'm happy to say that local communities have been capacitated to some extent or we have supported agency where they are actually aware of the power that they have to change their own situations. So in this case, they've got the power to change wasteful electricity practices in a way that saves electricity. It's, it's important to identify problems because what we've realized is that all the problems that we are facing, especially environmental problems, they are caused by us. So then we are then the people that are supposed to come up with the solutions. So I think it's, I think it's important that we as society need to be conscious of these challenges that we're facing. And, with, and more particularly in this project, we are all uh, conscious of electricity of it becoming a problem and its shortage becoming a problem. Hence then we were able to use this project to derive um, solutions on how to deal with electricity becoming a shortage. So this project has helped us in shaping these solutions. Hence we're then, as, as, as a collective, we, we managed to come up with solutions on how to deal with this problem. This project, this project is very important. This is a very, very important project. Not only as Abashali Basemakanda, but also as Abashali Banapim Sans Africa. We song as a jongene, num trading in with Talandelo Zumbani, Umbane, 
That's why we've got indoor panel low shedding. It's because of injela esibinsanga yumban. Now the project in Amanda Osbonisa injela esinga ati si saving a yumban. The project in Amanda ba singa kuas si save singa kuas save energy and also save is a man. Yes, I would recommend it to the community, and in such way that I wish it could be. He expand in such way that he broadcast to e radios, e billboards, e TV because about the balance we have number of years is in those in Mumbai and so we turn by so like number of twenty six eighteen for when he came one year so the film goes in jail so about the balance in such way but about years we project and about years how to save Mumbai in US we have in millions of Mumbai we have the film so we turn up we turn in the hundred grand for months when Mumbai and fifty units is fifty guys is sixty so I wish it could be. To expand the urban bias. The project to create a lab na in the tega cool. Ngoba umba ne uya sevi tega cool. Kuna kala, ane? Unzake lo beni na ya zi TSTV na ipso ku klasesi kuba ku bukela se ya zi switcher off yabo su kope i plugs even iketi le bezi kati zisha la e plugging si na kanga sibe kati se switcher off. So ever since ke ugu kule project. Stawo Tia ibole la kuhulu le project ya the roads. Ibole la kuhulu. O kuni isina tega kulifika ngi kisha eli bika kuhulu kuti kuba umba ne uye usko mwazishi saka kuhulu iyonezi. O kusabe na kutega kuhulu koko tosi kwa zilu kuseva kenga elba bes fundi sile. Kum akwa baba wongu mtobe na kufunda iambe iambe iye ifikele le kubandu bonge ukuza sasa useva kal ukuza kupele i i low shading. Ilunga toka cool because i i bani mi pumo e positive, ngapo. That's why no kwa amdi ni taka kwa apa kwa community, ukuti na yao mai kwa zii unge na kwa project. Partnerships and knowledge production is important. It's important in a sense that we realize that academics alone cannot come up with solutions. Um, to problems that are being faced by people. So it is important to come back to the people, civil society, the communities, and, and working together. So these partnerships are very important because we cannot only depend on academics to formulate, to create hypotheses, aims, and then come up with conclusions without actually working with us as community members and working out solutions. So those partnerships are important because we are the people who know how this affects us. It's all fine and good that it will be refined in academic spaces, but the raw material will come from us community because we are the people that are experiencing this firsthand. So partnerships are very important in that sense.